things. When you talk about what you do for a living, you say you're a butcher and you do whole animal things, you kind of get two different reactions. One is people are either very interested in it, um, the other is people are kind of grossed out by it. And I, I had a woman who said that she didn't like to think of meat as this way, she just wanted to be able to go to the store and have it out of a styrofoam package. To me, that just sounds horrible. I would actually you know, prefer to see my food broken down like this and know that the entire animal is being used. Sunday afternoon business is brisk at this old brick storefront in Kansas City's East Bottoms. Since 2012, the local pig, the brainchild of Chef Alex Pope, has been selling beef, pork, and chicken raised on farms no more than 100 miles away to customers willing to pay a little more in return for transparency. People want that relationship with whatever the product is. It doesn't have to be meat. They, they want a relationship with the people that are providing them those goods and services. Those relationships aren't trending just in this neighborhood. The USDA estimates that local food sales totaled $6.1 billion in 2012. That's a lot of people looking to learn more about what's on their plate. Part of doing locally sourced meat, you really got to educate your customer, and the easiest way to do that is to get them involved in it and put their hands on it. All right, so I will have you serve. That's why classes are offered every week. Could be sausage making or charcuterie tips. This one's about using the whole hog. And yes, sharp implements are part of the package. We've bought meat from local farmers and things, but never really seen it through the whole process. My wife actually bought me this as a gift, so I thought I owed it to her to come down and get my hands dirty. This is wonderful. I mean, I'm not going to be able to go home and do this, um, but I at least have an understanding of how it works. Anything else? Here in the Midwest, it seems like it's been an overnight changeover of just people wanting to know. They want to know what's going on, and they want to know what's in their food, and I think people are taking their health a little more seriously, and it does feel very right place, right time, for sure. For Harvest Public Media, I'm Randy Mason. I gotta go grill.